Hey guys, good morning. I am actually not here with a box opening today, though the box may suggest that, but actually with a box packing. Um, I already packed up the clothes. I have about five packages in here and I figured it would take forever to get through all of that if I like wanted to put it on film. So I just skipped that and I figured I'd show you all the little extra goodies I'm sending with the baby and then change her into her final outfit and then we'll we'll send her off so i put all of the little like all the clothes are over here and then i have some of these little air things just to like you know keep her protected if something were to happen and then all of the little extras are in this box so i have a note to her mama on top and then i kind of like instead of like tissue paper i put a little uh, extra like um bathing blanket um and then i threw in some extra diapers and some little bottles, um, a little pacifier in this little jewelry box. <laughs> We've got not jewelry, but some little extra uh, hair bows, which I thought were really sweet. I've got like five or six in here. I just went kind of crazy when I was packing up all this stuff. I was like, oh, she needs this. She needs this. She needs this. I've got a little hairbrush. Um, this came with her. I've never ever used this on her hair, but it's a, a conditioning detangler. So I figured I'd throw that in there with her. It's one of her originals though. I wouldn't recommend it. I've only used water on her hair. Um, some little extra scratch buttons and socks and a bib and a couple hats. So those are just all the little fun extras in addition to the clothing that I thought I would include with her. So... So there's that. I'll throw that back in the box and grab the baby. We'll change her into her final outfit. Um, all I did with last night was, I mean, she didn't need any powder, but I powdered her a little tiny bit. And then I asked her mama, I was like, well, do you want me to change her outfit? So yeah, there's the first half of the box opening. And then on top, I'm gonna do, um, the baby and then do a layer of bubble wrap is the game plan so so she will be nice and protected lord only knows how expensive this is going to be to ship because this is actually the first doll i've sold guys like i'm such a hoarder <laughs> I, I get a baby and then i just want to keep them forever but you know it's kind of it's the nature of the hobby i have really loved this baby so right now she's just wearing a little like um fleece sleeper with a little um um wiener dog on it but she is going to change so that it's a surprise because every safety video I sent to her, to her new mama, she's been wearing this. So I was like, hey, you know, like I'll change her if you want to be surprised. And she's like, yeah, yeah, I do that. <laughs> so, so that is what I will do. I wonder if I should change her diaper too. I'll just leave her in this, like this one, I guess. All right. So. So here she is, here's the little one being sold. Um, it's Summer by Caroline Nelson. You guys have seen her around on my channel a bit, I think. I've had her since July of 2019, so about a year and a half. Let me unbutton the back here so that I don't have to take it over her head. So yeah, I've had her about a year and a half and my collection has just grown. She was the second baby I ever purchased. And my collection has just grown exponentially. <laughs> I think I have, um, what, 10 dolls now, which is kind of crazy. Um, hold on, I don't wanna, don't wanna force this. Let me get this sleeve off of her. There we go, okay. Hopefully the light's okay. It's kinda early, early morning. I'm still on that work grind like get up at 6 a.m work till 2 in the morning like busy season hours <laughs> so, so it's kind of early in the morning here but oh look how beautiful she is i think this baby has such beautiful coloring i don't know if the camera is like picking it up or not but she really is she's very pretty um so the outfit i picked for her to go home in is a little me set it's actually preemie size, so hopefully it'll fit her okay. This baby can wear preemie and newborn, like, no problem. So, and I got this in a box opening, actually, from another, um, 
when I had um, my birdie painted by Myra's Little Bugs. And I think this is absolutely precious. But I figure I'll, I'll gift it on just because it's so pretty. And you can see the back. It's um, a light pink with little flowers and it's got little ruffles and a bow on the back. <laughs> but I thought it would look really nice on her, especially with her coloring. And bonus, it comes with a hat, so it'll keep her hair extra protected. I'm going to keep the, the cling wrap around it um, and put a diaper over her head. But yeah, let's go ahead and change her. Unbutton this. All right. Hopefully it fits her all right. I haven't tried this on her yet. Penny, stop. Sorry, that's my little cat. If you can see her, she's messing around with the plastic here. <laughs> she wants some attention this morning. I haven't fed her yet. <laughs> can you all see her? She's ridiculous. Penny, stop. You know, it's better, you know, she has never ever touched these babies, so at least there's that. She'll like come up and sniff them, but oh, this is gonna be a perfect fit. Look at that. Oh, I love that. And I'll keep these scratch mittens on her, and I kept the socks on her too, just to keep an extra layer of protection there. I'm a little bit paranoid about shipping her. She's she's going like seven or eight states away, but still. Hopefully nothing happens. I'm gonna send her with um, signature required so that I know for sure that she gets where she needs to go. Oh, this is gonna fit her perfectly. I'm so excited. This looks so beautiful on her. Okay, let me finish buttoning it up. And then I will take her off camera for one sec and brush her hair real quick. I've got my little toothbrush here. So I'll give her hair a once over and then put the plastic if Penny will let me. Can you stop please? Thank you. <laughs> She's a silly little cat. Just trying to play with the toothbrush now. All right. So you guys can enjoy staring at my little cat <laughs> for a second while I brush her hair or here I can show you. <laughs> All right, so this little blondie has officially found a new mama and she is heading to her new home. Let me brush the back of her hair. Penny, get off that. I don't want cat hair on anything. Oh, goodness gracious. I might have to uncat hairify the little blanket she's going home in before I actually send her off. Let me finish brushing her hair. Sorry, guys. All right, there we go. Penny, please stop. She's very uh, playful this morning. She's usually a very calm, like, very chill cat, but <laughs> she wants to be fed and she wants to play early in the morning and then as the day goes on, she just gets more and more sleepy. Which is <laughs> just kind of funny. Okay, there we go. And I stuck the hat on her, which also fits her very nicely. So there she is. All right, I'm gonna put a diaper on her head. Oh, this is so odd, <laughs> packing her up. But there she is, last outfit by me. <laughs> All right, and she's gonna fit in this blanket really well too. All right, so I grabbed a diaper for her head and then I have another blanket. Let's see, I guess I'll put it around her whole body. Honey, can you please stop? She's being <laughs> a ridiculous little cat this morning. All right, and then I have another blanket for her. Am I crazy, guys? Does everyone do box packings this way? Just 90 layers of blankets and bubble wrap and <laughs> soft things just out of paranoia. <laughs> All right, let's put this over her head. Bye, little baby.
baby. All right. So there's that. Our little diaper head. And then I'll put this around her body, I guess. Okay, let me grab her again. I'll just kind of do it like this. <laughs> Who wants to take bets that my cat is gonna hop in this box? Unfortunately, you are not going anywhere, little one. She's a little too long for this, but that's all right. All right, first layer blanket done. And now we'll wrap her in this blanket. All right, there we go. She is, actually, you know what? I'm just gonna put, let me stick this on there. One last time. <laughs> we'll stick this in there with her. Let's put it in this layer. That way it's more of a surprise. Penny, please stop. <laughs> She's trying to get at everything. Okay, so now she has a little lovey in there traveling with her. All right, there we go. I think I'm just gonna stick her in there and then do a layer of bubble wrap on top of her and call it a day. So there she is. There's the box, if you can see it. All ready to go. And here's the baby. We will just stick her in there like that. It'll all fit perfectly. And then we'll just, you know, bubble wrap this baby up and, and call it a day. Time to head off to the post office. And that's that. <laughs> well, I appreciate y'all watching. If you wanna um, watch my collection grow even more, <laughs> Even though this baby is leaving, I do have another one coming, and the um, USPS, the app says she'll be here Monday, so. So yeah, though this is sad. I'm sad to see this baby go. There's definitely exciting things coming, so. Stay tuned, y'all, and I hope y'all have a great day and great weekend. All right, thanks for watching, bye.